What's up, everybody? This your boy Chris Rebeats back with another video. In this video, man, we're gonna cook up some R&B trap soul type beats. Um, we're going to be playing some piano, and we're just gonna jam out on reason, man. Hope you guys enjoy this video, and yeah, man, I'm gonna uh, give you guys some tips and tricks uh, during the process of how we're gonna cook this beat up. All right. Alright, so we got a cool little piano chord progression going. So what we want to do right now is add in a soft lead. Uh, so we're going to pull up Analog Lab and find us a nice soft lead. Uh, let's just put soft, see what they can find with that. Okay, cool. Let's lay that down. Cool. Now let's uh, go ahead and copy that pattern over. Mm, now let's add some variation to that last note and change it to a G instead of the A sharp. All right, cool. So with R&B, we got the chord, we got a soft line. So really with R&B, what's going to really add it some flavor and give it that vibe is the bass line. Uh, so let's go ahead and add in a bass line here. Um, so we're going to pull up our monotone bass synthesizer. Usually I like to mess around with these settings and make my own. But actually what I'm going to do right now is go into rack extensions and find this uh, monotone folder. And let's lay it down. I like it. All right, so at this point, I'll add in like maybe some more roads or electric piano. So I'm with some movement into it. So, uh, All right, at this point, I definitely need to grab some guitar, uh, maybe add in like a little electric guitar line. So let me grab my guitar real quick. I'm gonna lay down this guitar right here. So now that we pretty much have a good little foundation here with this, um, we also can change up our guitar chord since we played a couple different versions of it.
something to just kind of give it a little bit of sound, a little bit of ear candy, as I heard they call it. All right, so I think we're just gonna add this kick in on the one, and um, that'll do it for the drums. So with that, that's going to lay down pretty much the basis of this beat. I think what I'm going to do right now is do some sequencing and some mixing, and then I'll let you guys hear what the final beat sounds like. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like because it definitely helps our channel to grow. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. That way you'll be notified the next time we have a beat cook up or reason tutorial uploaded to our channel. Drop a comment below with the next suggestion of beat cook up you guys would like to see. And until next time, peace.